This is the second part of the lane box from Hack the Box. I'm going to do this without using the uh, Metasploit framework. So if we remember from our uh, previous video, we got the we compromised the SMB port and this disk CCD using the Metasploit uh, framework. Um, so to do this without, we're going to concentrate on the SMB port first. Here. We, we know the version number, so we can see if there's a CVE associated with this. So we could just do a simple Google search for this here and then type in CVE. We can have a look at the CVEdetails.com. And there are quite a few um, CVEs associated with this here on this particular version. So to narrow it down a bit, if we was have a look at our um, Metasploit, we know that the description is Samba user map script command execution. So we can take the username and see if there's anything associated with this. Uh, okay. Uh, use a map script. CVE 20072447. We just click on it. We know that there's a Metasploit module associated with this here. Okay, so if we was to do a search for this, we will see that somebody has, uh, has wrote a script um to exploit this cve here and these are the parameters to use and this is the script all right here so we can just simply take this it's created a new folder and that is our script that we need to use just to make this small I just grab the my IP address and I need to set up a netcat listener we'll use one two three four So that's 10.10.10.3 on port 139. My IP is 10.10.14.20. We use it 1.2.3.4. Payload set, check netcat. And we are in using this method. The other way of doing this is using that other port as previously described. So this would be uh, the disk CCD. So I've already gone ahead and run another Nmap scan using the Vuln script that you can use within Nmap. So this is the script I used here and these are the other parameters. Uh, it didn't actually pick up anything for SMB, but there are other scripts that you can run using uh, to use for uh, SMB. Um, so it's managed to find this vulnerability here, and it's even telling us it's exploitable. So let's just do a search for this.
and this would this would be the the framework that or the module that we used in the previous video but we don't want to use this we want to use um, uh, something else let's have a look is this it Again, this is just a, a Python script that somebody's um, put together. So we can have a look at this here. It's even telling us the parameters to use. Uh, it doesn't look like we can get clone it. We can just do this. We can grab all this here and paste it. And we'll call this exploit.python. Okay, we don't need that. Let's change its mod. Okay. So again, we need to set up another netcat listener. We'll use one, two, three, four. Uh, dash T, I guess that's target on the port uh, 3632 dash C. Let's match how he's got everything here. NC. On one two three four, we do dash e slash bin slash sh. And we have a connection. And we're that user again. So you just go through the same uh, previous escalation steps as previously described, and you will get root that way. Um, I think that is it for this video. Thank you for watching.